and today I'm going to be filming another video and it is going to be what is in my backpack and my gym bag, sort of. I'm just going to be like showing you through. I don't know if I'll put it in the title yet, but anyways. So this is my backpack. It is the Jan Sports one. I'll link it down below. I know it's the old version or maybe even the old, old version, but I've had it for three years and it is amazing. Like I'm probably going to be able to keep it for eighth grade too. Like, I love it so much. And it was only, I mean, it was kind of expensive. Jansport is kind of expensive. But it was like $30 to $40. I don't know, but I love this so much. It is in perfect condition. Like, it is dirty because I haven't cleaned it. But I love it so much. So I want to show you what is inside the love of my life. So, first I'm going to start at the bottom pocket right here. And this is where I keep all of my flashcards and, you know, empty flashcard things. And so here's my flashcard thing. This is just like a, a pencil case thing. And I just have this empty spiral thing of flashcards. And I have some language arts ones, some math ones, some science, uh, Spanish, and more Spanish, and more Spanish, and social studies. So that is what is in this bag. And the other one up here, I have my makeup slash cosmetic bag. And in here, well, first of all, this set is from Target, I think. It came with like a medium one and then a bigger one. The biggest one is this pattern, and then the medium one's like blue polka dots. And in here, I just some clips for my hair, and I showed this in my wits in my purse video, but I have to have these, especially after gym, like, must have. And then I just have some oil blotting sheets, and this is Clean and Clear Oil Absorbing Sheets Portable, and it says it instantly removes excess oil, won't feel so much makeup, and it's just by brand Johnson by Johnson. And this comes with 50 sheets, and I use this after gym sometimes. I mean, this is just, like, in case I'm going somewhere. Or, yeah. And then I have a Maybelline Baby Lips. And this is the, uh, what's it called? It is called Peppermint. Yes. And it is just clear. See, it comes on clear and it gives, like, a little shine. Whoa, that comes up really well. But, yes. And I really like this. Oh, and it smells so good. It smells like peppermint, obviously. And it has SPF 20, which is really good. And then I have a nail file. And I once again show this in my What's in My Purse. This is the Miss Pedicure. And this is good because I actually just got my nails done. And then they started to come off. But yeah, this is good. And then I just have some you know, fem feminine products. And then I have some Bath & Body Works lotion. This is in brown sugar and fig. And... Oh, it smells so good. And this is actually, like, really helpful, especially before gym, if I'm, like, ashy or something like that. I love using that. And then I have two hair bands, which I usually have one on my wrist, but this is in case, like, someone else needs one. And these are, like, brand new ones, and so if someone else needs one, I'm like, just keep it, girl. And then I have some more chapstick, and this I actually made homemade a while ago, and I'll see if I can find the video link down below. But, I mean, if not, you can just find, like, homemade chapstick or whatever. And this one is the scent almond. You can see, like, the almond piece at the bottom. But this is, like, basically the same as the Maybelline Baby Lips. It's on top right there. But, yeah, it's just normal chapstick. Nothing special. But, yeah. And then I have some Q-tips in case my, like, mascara or something smudges and I need to fix it up. Those are really helpful, too. And then, next... I have, what I love about this, it has like a secret pocket right here. I think that is like amazing. And it's just right here and it's just like a little, let me see if you can see it, just like a little corner pocket. And it goes like super deep, like all the way to like down here. And in here I have some money, this is just like a $5 bill in case I want to get something from the vending machine. Or if they're selling like sports clothes or something and I want to get some. And then I have some gum, because you need to hide gum from people. And this is the perfect spot. And I would also keep, where did I put it? Oh, my phone. But it is up there on my desk, but I would keep my phone in here too, just so, like, 
no one takes it or anything. And then this pocket right here, the first one or the second one, like if you're going like this, is, uh, where's the zipper? Isn't really anything. I would normally keep my book, but it's up there. And then, see, it's right here. There's actually really nothing in here. But, I mean, there's a pencil. Free pencil! Book and agenda in here. Wait, if I'm, like, going to school. But then, in this one, this is my main one right here. In here, I keep my pencil pouch, which this one's from, like, Office Depot or something. This one, like, everyone has. And then, this is it. And it just has this big zipper here, which I keep all of my, I have some flashcards in there, but I have some like pens and pencils, and it is really messy because it's like more than halfway into the year, and here I just have some pencil sharpener, an eraser, some scissors, some pride pennies, and another eraser, and a piece of paper of what book I get to read, and then I have my agenda. My second love of my life. I might as well just be having an affair, honestly. So, this is from Target, and it's just this, like, cool, like, flimsy pattern. Like, it's one of those things where, like, if you put your finger on, you can, like, make a mark. I don't know, I think that's really cool and weird. But it's, like, it's coming out blue, but it's, like, this green teal. Oh, it's actually, like, the exact color of my shirt. That is so weird. But I just have a paper clip right there that marks my spot, so I just, like, but I just flip to there. And see, I had written, like, no school, no school, and then my homework for Thursday, and then on the side, Friday. But, yes, I love this. Like, you can tell I use this a ton. Like, honestly, I don't know what I would do without this. This is, like, I mean, really, that's, like, for one week. I write stuff that doesn't even, like, pertain to school. <sighs> and then, first, I have my electives binder, and this is a half inch or one inch. I don't know, wait, let me see. The foam thing. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's a one inch. But this is my electives binder, and here's I just have like Spanish stuff right there, and then um, I have health stuff right there, and then yes, and I also have a pencil holder in there too. That's just from Target, I think. And so there's my first binder. And then I have my science stuff, which I don't have a binder for this, but I think I'm going to have to get a binder because she's starting to make it so we have to have, like, sections. And this is, like, one of these super cool, like, six-pocket ones. But I think I'm going to have to get a binder. I'll probably get another one of these. But, yeah. So this just says science up here. And I just have my, like, notes here, handouts here. If you go to my school, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And then, like, tests and quizzes here. And then I have my science notebook, which I just have. Right now we're learning about genetics. So comment down below if you are too, because like, you know, mitosis, meiosis, and chromosomes. and My next binder, I know I have like all different sizes of binders, it's really weird. But this one is, I don't know what it's called, I think it's like the case one, but this thing totally broke. But yeah, this one's really nice. I just keep my social studies and math stuff, because basically all my classes I have a table of contents for science, social studies, and math. So this is basically what it looks like if you've never seen it. It's just like, it says like table contents, and like one, two, three, blah, blah, blah. And then I have that for math. And then for social studies, I have that too. We don't have as much stuff, but it's just a white one. And then that's that. And then for my, this is my homework folder, which Okay, I have just so many loves in my life. So this is my third love of my life. Maybe my second, I don't know. But it has, it's, this is my homework folder. It has four tabs. So on the first one, I keep just like stuff like my report cards, my bathroom pass, my test scores, just like stuff I need to like show my parents. And then next, I have my smart lunch stuff. And then my, um, what's it called? Spanish homework. Like my elective section. And then right here I have, oh shoot, I just remembered I have language arts homework. Ugh. My language arts homework, my science homework, which just actually isn't homework, this is just stuff I brought home to study. And then my math, which I have nothing. 
And then sausages, which I have nothing. So happy. And back here I have like my like gems, homework and stuff. I haven't even started that. It's just like this thing. It's like beta club basically. And then oh, and then also has this section which is for like a laptop because it says like fits 17 inch. But I don't bring my laptop to school. So I just keep extra paper and extra um, sheet protectors, which is so, so helpful because, like, if I run out of paper, I can just go, like, in between classes and get some. So that is my book bag, and I would normally have, like, water or Gatorade in here, but I really hope you guys enjoyed. So now I'm going to be showing you my gym bag, and this one I won at this volleyball camp, but you can basically just get it anywhere. But, yeah, so, in here, I'm actually not in gym now, but I just, like, threw this stuff in. I keep some leggings in case it's cold out and we're going outside. And then I have some shorts in case we're staying inside. Right here. These are from Target, and so are these. And then I have my shirt, which I will show you the back of, because it has school, um, like, name and mascot on it. But it just looks like this, and it's gray, and it has, like, blue on the front. And yeah, and then in here I also have some socks, and I would normally have my tennis shoes in there. But if I was to have gym, I would in here I would have basically the same stuff. I would just add a powder in case this is my L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Powder in nude beige, and this is like my fourth love of my life. And because I have hit total pan on this, I can like barely get the stuff around the edge. I'm probably just gonna have to get a new one. But what I like is it has a mirror. Peace. Where am I? Peace. Anyway, so it has this little sponge, which is perfect to, like, so I don't have to bring a whole brush because that would be so annoying. But there's that. And then I have, well, I'd bring, like, whatever eyeliner when I was wearing, and this isn't waterproof, so I'd probably bring this in case, like, it, you know, messes up. This is the Ulta Contour Eye Pencil in, what's it called? Black Smoke. And, yeah, let me swatch it. It looks like this. I actually need to sharpen it. It's like going me. But it just looks like that. And yeah. I will also bring a concealer. This is my e.l.f. concealer. This is nice and like portable. I actually like totally ran out of it. It's like I can like barely get anything out of it. If you can see it's right there. But yeah. Because like it won't like push up anymore. So like the pokey thing is like right there. But I also bring my deodorant. And this is like liquid. This is the 72 hour protection and hyper, hypoallergenic dry idea advanced dry unscented. This is so amazing. This is like, I don't use like the secret stuff, but it is just this like roller ball thing and I guess a little swatch, I don't know, like, like it just like goes on like that and it's like liquid. I guess, I don't know why I swatched that guys, but it's just like liquid and then but, like, when you put it on, it's not liquid, like, you oh, know, it's a little disgusting. Okay, well, that is it, and I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, and I will talk to you later. Bye. I'm going to go clean my hand.